Hey! Uncle Robert and Aunt Ryoko! I'm glad you're both here. You guys too, Dad. What a relief! I was so worried. What's going on, Dad? Is Aldian attacking? Probably not. From the looks of their weapons, it's most likely... Most likely what? Never mind. We must get out of here. Let's go. Please wait here. Is something wrong? There's a long line to use the transporter up ahead. You'll have to wait your turn here. I see. We'll wait then. Damn! How'd they get in this far? Get going! Keep moving forward! Here. Yeah. Here they are. Run for it. Robert. Yes. As I suspected. Run, you two! Uncle Robert? Just get out of here! But... Get moving now! You have to protect her! That's right, hurry! Don't worry about us! It's alright. We'll be at the evacuation facility soon. Promise, Dad? Promise. Let's go, Sophia. Okay. They're getting away! Use the incapacitator! Take 
take care of that one. Let's go, you two. I'll give it my best shot. Let's for the help. No problem, Emma. But we should get out of here. There'll be more of those things coming. It's already a complete disaster over that way. Come on! Let's get out of here! A complete disaster? Hey, but wait my a parents! Second. Fate! Forget it! Didn't you hear, Pepita? It's too dangerous back that way! But... Forget it! Come on, you two! I already said it was too dangerous! Please, stop him! He says he's going back! Mom and Dad are back there. I have to go help them. Out of my way! Didn't you hear me? It's an inferno back there! It's way too dangerous! Come on, you two, out of my way! Let me go! Let me go! Look! We'll all die if we don't get out of here! Now! Welcome to Aruba Shelter 5. This is an evacuation shelter located underneath Haida 4. Please wait in your assigned rooms until the rescue ship arrives. You are allowed to move freely about the facility, but there are some restricted areas. Please refer to the consoles or ask the nearest official for detailed instructions. All right then.
Shall we go? There's nothing left to do here anyway. I'm sure your parents are okay. Don't worry. Yeah, I know. Let's go. Oh, one second, please. You've been assigned to room 506. Remember that. Okay. 506, got it. I expect the rescue transports will be here soon. Please try to relax and wait. Okay.
Ah, your parents. Ah, well, what can you do, eh? Hey, at least you're still alive, eh? Oh, Ganella. You should really watch your tongue. No, it's okay. It's just like he said. Even if I went to help them, I wouldn't have been able to do anything. If only I was a little stronger. Fate. Strength, it's not enough. You can't beat them. He's right. It's not your fault. I bet they were professional soldiers. There's nothing we can do against people like that. And you know... Just because they didn't make it to this evacuation facility doesn't mean your parents are dead. You know, they might be hiding out somewhere. Don't give up so soon. Or they might have been captured or something, eh? Ganella! It's all right. If they've been captured, then you can go rescue them. Anyway, you'll just have to wait a little longer. What could you possibly do right now? We don't even know what's going on. Yeah, you're right. Why don't you go to your room and rest a bit? You're too tired to do anything right now. Or you could just rest here with us. Wouldn't you feel safer here with everyone? Thank you, but I'm fine. I want to think things over anyway. Uh, okay.
okay? Yeah, I think. You're exhausted. You should rest. Yeah. Just rest. Um, Fate? What is it? Will you stay here until I fall asleep? I don't want to be alone. Sure, I'll stay. Just relax and go to sleep. Thanks. Good night. Now! Hey, what's that sound? Sounds like they're going to make an announcement. This is an update for all refugees. We now know the recent raid on the resort planet Haida was a surprise attack by Vendine. Vendine? Aren't they that military power that's currently at war with Aldian? They did turn down the Federation's offer of aid some time ago, but there were no open hostilities. Remote Station 7 mounted an attempt to defend Haida 4, but it was thwarted by a tactical Vendini strike. Currently, the Pan Galactic Administration is scrambling ships from surrounding regions but Vendini forces still have control of the sector. We request that all civilians begin boarding rescue shuttles for immediate evacuation to Remote Station 6. Please do not panic. Refer to the nearest console or attendant for further instructions. Sophia, we gotta go. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. A little sleep helped calm me down. Hold on just a little longer. We'll be safe once we reach Remote Station 6. Okay. Computer. Tell me the present location of Robert and Ryoko Leingard. The present location of the specified individuals is unknown. What do you mean, unknown? Both Robert Leingard and Ryoko Leingard's positions were lost on Galactic Year 772. One, two, one, four, one, nine, two. Three. Lost? What then? The information system is currently experiencing technical difficulties. Confirmation is not possible at present.
What? Oh no! Welcome to the Federation transport ship GFSS-12372 Hellera. You must have been through a lot. We will soon be departing for remote station 6. The observation bay is located directly through the corridor leading out of this room. Please wait there until we reach our destination. Gravitic Warp will get us there shortly. Watching something. Huh? You're right. What is that? Something on the monitor? Let's take a look. Okay. Oh, oh no! It's worse than I thought. This is horrible. Gravitic warp to escape the battle zone. I repeat, we are about to enter gravitic warp to escape the battle zone. All evacuees prepare for warp turbulence. you up sorry no it's all right where do you think we are now I wonder there haven't been any announcements yet we should ask one of the crew Yeah, good idea.
Navigator, status report. Yes, Captain. We were cruising at warp 15 on course 231, mark 330, when the gravitic warp field collapsed and the computer detected an anomaly, forcing us to return to conventional space. Computer, what caused the ship's warp field to collapse? There is not enough data to determine the cause. All right. Even if you can't determine the cause, how about a theory? Prior to the collapse, sensors detected a space-time disturbance. Our database does not contain any record of such a disturbance. But there is a 77% probability it was the cause of the collapse. Space-time disturbance? Come to think of it, Vendini military technology is based on space-time manipulation. That is not an established fact, but the Federation Institute of Technology has theorized this is the case. So it was likely a Vendini attack that stopped us then. Screen on! Damn! Divert all power to shields! Evasion course 291, mark 030. Enter. So that's a Vendini battleship. A rescue frigate's shields are no match for the likes of that. Thank you. This is your captain speaking. Our ship is currently under attack by a Vendini battleship. The Vidic warp engine has already been disabled, which means escape is not an option. All 
all power has been diverted to our shields to buy us some time. I wanted you all to know, our chances are slim. I had hoped to transport you all the way to remote station 6. But it seems that is now beyond my power. All evacuees are requested to proceed to the ship's escape pods. Please remain calm and follow the instructions of the attendant nearest you as you board your pod. Good luck to you all. A direct hit?
Ben's still here. Get in, quick! We're running out of time. Wait. I'm scared. Don't worry. But... The Federation ship will recover our pods in no time. I'll see you at Remote Station 6. Now get going! Okay. You'll follow, right? Promise? Promise. Activation complete. Ejection in 10 seconds. Distress signal operational. Okay. Searching for life-supporting planets. Planet found. Where? Vanguard 3, located approximately 0.5 light years from present location. Axial tilt of 35 degrees results in extreme seasonal weather. Existence of humanoid life forms confirmed. The Federation has classified Vanguard 3 as an underdeveloped planet, civilization level approximately equivalent to 16th century Earth. Would you like to review the underdeveloped planet preservation pact? Yes. The underdeveloped planet preservation pact was established in order to protect planets with developing civilizations. Contact with civilizations that have not reached a certain level of development is strictly prohibited by Federation law. This is due to the fact that contact with advanced civilizations has a high probability of greatly influencing the course of history on a less developed planet. All individuals and organizations belonging to the Pan-Galactic Federation are required to adhere to the tenets of this pact, unless faced with a clear danger to life and limb. This pact is one of the most important components of Pan-Galactic Federation law. It also serves as a guideline for civilian conduct in emergency situations. Violators will be tried by the Pan-Galactic Council. How long till we get there? At our present speed of warp 6, arrival is estimated in 144 hours. Are there any foreseeable problems in getting to Vanguard 3? How's our energy reserves? No foreseeable problems. An adequate supply of energy and food is on board. Okay, I guess I'll get some sleep. Notify me if anything happens. Affirmative.
Entering Vanguard 3's gravitational field. Prepare for entry turbulence. Here we go. <clears throat> so this is Vanguard 3. Since they haven't contacted me yet, I suppose it'll be a few days before they come rescue me. And I better keep an eye out for danger. After all, this is an underdeveloped planet. Hmm? My quad scanner's picking something up. Moving at 40 clicks. Might be an animal. I hope it's not dangerous. I should use my replicator to make myself a weapon, just in case. A sword would be a good match for this planet's level of development. For violating the UP3. Luckily, I've gotten used to this kind of weapon in the battle simulators. Not that I feel very lucky right now. I sure hope I don't end up having to use this thing. Yeah. That feels about right. The sun will be setting soon. I better find someplace safer to stay by nightfall. If there is any safe place on this planet. Huh? There's something there. I'll try expanding the range a bit. Picking up humanoids. Based on this reading, I'd guess it's a village. If I start out now, I might be able to make it by nightfall. <clears throat> I'll go. I know it's a UP3 infringement, but this is an emergency. They'll probably cut me some slack if I keep a low profile. <laughs> 